In this video, we will be calibrating the Kavita Micro Plus Smokerlyzer. Here we have the Micro Plus Pro model of the Smokerlyzer family. However, you can follow these same steps to calibrate the Micro Plus Baby and Micro Plus Basic monitors. Before we get started, I'd like to share a quick tip. You can go to www.covita.net for calibration tips and quick start guides, which can be found under the help section. Once in the help section, you will see general calibration information. As you scroll down, you will see Smokerlyzer educational resources. On the left side of your screen, you can select your Smokerlyzer monitor to find material on training courses, monitor information, and calibration help. Also, remember to never block the vent holes on the Micro Plus Smokerlyzer. Before we begin calibration, we will need a D-piece, a 20 ppm carbon monoxide calibration can, a 1 liter per minute regulator, and a Kali adapter, along with your monitor. Now that we have all our supplies, we can begin the calibration steps. If you are missing any of these items, feel free to give us a call here at Covita or go to our website to place an order. Remove the black dust cap from the can of gas. Ensure the control valve on the flow meter regulator is in the off position by twisting the valve clockwise. Screw the regulator flow meter onto the gas can. Some slight pressure may be required. This can be done by screwing the gas can into the regulator. Once this is done, verify the gauge on the regulator flow meter is registering gas. Attach the small end of the Kali adapter tubing into the regulator flow meter. Insert the larger end of the Kali adapter tubing into the round hole of the D-piece. We are now ready to calibrate. Now that our calibration kit is assembled, we can turn on the monitor and press the gear icon to get to the settings menu. Once on the settings screen, press the icon that resembles your calibration kit to begin pre-calibration zeroing. While zeroing, the monitor will display an hourglass. Once zeroing is complete, the monitor will show assembly of the calibration kit. Click the arrow below to move on to the next screen, which will display the D-piece being attached to the bigger end of the Kali adapter. Ensure there are no kinks in the tubing to prevent a failed calibration and insert the D-piece into the monitor. Now that the monitor and calibration kit are fully assembled, press the arrow once more to get to the final calibration step. At this point, we may now turn the gas on and press the arrow to begin calibration. An hourglass will appear indicating the monitor is now calibrating. While the monitor is calibrating, I would like to remind you to calibrate your monitor every six months, replace your D-piece every month for proper infection control, and Covita provides five-year warranties on all new MicroPlus family smokerizers and lifetime support and online training. If you're having trouble with calibration, you can check out our troubleshooting video in the description below. Now that calibration is complete, ensure you turn off the calibration regulator and press the green check mark to lock in calibration. Congratulations, you have successfully calibrated your Smokerlyzer monitor. After calibration, please remove the flow meter regulator from the gas can. You may hear a pop and this is normal. Remember to replace the dust cap for proper storage. We value and appreciate you being a part of the Covita family. Thank you for watching.